Excessive heat warnings across the area have hit those without homes the hardest. But today, the Salvation Army's Homeless Task Force in Tupelo held a meeting to talk about solutions. WTVA's Gardner Montgomery joins us live at the Salvation Army on Carnation Street to share how they're solving the crisis. Right now, it's 98 degrees out here in Tupelo. Heat index is 110, but don't worry about me. I have a work issued vehicle with air conditioning that I'm gonna be able to hop in with my equipment as soon as I'm done talking with you. But not everyone has the luxury of having a cool place to stay during this excessive heat. That's one of the reasons the Homeless Task Force met today at Tupelo Police Department, and they discussed a lot of future plans. A lot of them are to be announced, but they also wanted to talk about how to find solutions for the issues homeless people are facing right now in this heat. And they're doing that by, one, by allowing non-residents to stay in their lodge during the daytime when it's usually closed. There's air conditioning and there's ways to cool off in there, but they'll also have a hydration station at the gym where they can get a cold drink. The drink, the gym has been closed for a while due to plumbing issues, but at noon o'clock today, they were able to open the gym back up. So Salvation Army has actively worked to get that situation fixed. And now people can enjoy their gym and enjoy the cool air in that gym right now. But if the Salvation Army isn't the most convenient place for you, Captain Leanna Marion says there are other places that you can go to to cool off. The library was a great place for people to go um, to seek it's a public place, um, there's restrooms, it's cool. Um, as long as they're acting appropriately and behaving themselves, then that is an opportunity for them to go. Sometimes um, some of the local stores or businesses where they can shop, um, they can go in there for a little bit of respite. So if you don't have easy access to cool air, you still need to prioritize your health, take advantage of some of these opportunities that these public places are, will be able to have so you can just stay cool and stay hydrated during this horrible, horrible hot weather. Reporting live from Tupelo, Gordon Montgomery, WTVA 9 News.